Welcome back. In the previous part, we arrived in Rito Village here. And we're searching for a little yellow dot, which we can see is over there somewhere. It's on the map. It's like it's down there. Or is it above us? Could be above us. I feel like it's probably above us, isn't it? Hmm. So let's have a little wander around then. So we didn't get much time to explore this place at the end of the previous parts. So what's, what's this? So this is the uh, uh, shop for armor and stuff. Like, ooh. I like this. It's kind of cool. So it's cold resistance. Oh, oh 1,000 rupees. Go on, then. It's like, there go all my rupees, but it's like, okay. How much is that? Cold resistance again. 600. I could have got that. Ah. What do I have to sell? That's the question. Probably not much. Not much at all. At least we've got some cold resistance. I'll probably get some more rupees in between the parts at some point. We've got here. Hello. Sob, sniff. What's wrong? The divine beast, Vah Meadow, in the sky is the worst. Molly's dad got hurt and Toonin's dad disappeared. Mom and big sis or my, uh, my little sis are all sad. Why? And I can't do anything to help. Oh dear. So what's the big birdie thing he do? That's the question. Because I've seen it flying off in the distance before, but it's like... What is it actually doing? What is it? I mean, I know it's a divine beast, sure. But what's what's its responsibility right now? What's it doing? I saw that down there. There's something that said a betty. Oh hello. Oh, you're the one we're meant to see. Cause the yellow dots here on the map. Hello. Ah, visitor, welcome to Oh! Oh! oh object on your hip, could it be? Give me, where are my manners? I am Canale, I think, elder of Rito Village. Now oh, then, is that not a chic of slate dangling from your hip? That's right. Oh my, so it is true. That means you must be a champion like Master of Ali, uh, one of the few able to, to, to board Divine Beast of our meadow. What am I thinking? The champions have all been dead for a hundred years. This boy must be a mere descendant, an inheritor of the Sheikah Slate. Ah, forgive me. Champion descendant, if you would listen to this old man's request, you will have my eternal gratitude. I'll listen. Thank you truly. Now that I know you have the blood of a champion, there is something I must ask of you. How shall I put this? I would like you to deal with Divine Beast Van Meadow, uh, the giant beast circling above us. Only a chosen one, a, a champion, could stop a divine beast. Uh, you must enter the beast and bend it to your will. I tried explaining this to more headstrong Rita warriors, but they wouldn't listen to reason. Teba and Half tried to confront Meadow, but it did not go well, and Half was injured. Tabe escaped and escaped, but I fear he now plans to face Meadow alone. As a descendant of the champions, perhaps you can help us. Perhaps. Perhaps. Where did I get that from? Please find Tabe. If you work together, you may be able to stop Divine Beast Va Meadow. Alright then. Hello! Ah, uh, scared of the bird monster. It doesn't eat me. Did the village elder tell you about it? Are you scared of it too? I'm a little scared. Aww. But you're much bigger than me. If you're scared, I'm doomed. What should I do? Oh, I've got it. I'll feed it lots of fish until it's stuffed to eat me. It's too stuffed to eat me. <gasps> what if when I try to give it the fish, it eats me instead? <gasps> oh dear, oh dear. I like the line of logic there, though. All right, are you the one we're going to speak to? No, oh, no. Uh, uh, forgive my intrusion, but I overheard you speaking with the Elder. Sounds like you intend to help my husband, Teba, in the fight against Meadow. But to tell the truth, there's not much I can do for you right now beyond telling you where my husband went. Where did he go? So it is you was meant to speak to. Well, my husband headed for a place called the Flight Range. It's in Ronox Pass at the base of the Hebra Mountains. It's a place where Rito warriors prepare for aerial combat. I imagine he's gone there to gather weapons for another run at Meadow. 
As it happens, he made his way to the flight range on the floor, on the floor, on foot this time. If you take off from Rivali's Landing, it's a straight shot down to the flight range. Rivali's Landing is a memorial for the Rito champion Rivali. So named in the hope that none might forget the events of that horrible day. Yeah, keep zooming in. Zoom, 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 zoom. Impressive, I know. Very few can achieve a mastery of the sky. Yet I have made an art of creating an updraft that allows me to soar. It's considered to be quite the masterpiece of aerial techniques, even among the Rito. With proper utilization of my superior skills, I see no reason why we couldn't easily dispense with Ganon. Now then, my ability to explore the firmament is certainly of note. But let's not, pardon me for being so blunt, let's not forget the fact that I am the most skilled archer of all the Rito. Yet despite these truths, it seems that I have been tapped to merely assist you. All because you happen to have that little darkness ceiling sword on your back. I mean, it's just asinine. Unless you think you can prove me wrong, maybe we should just settle this one on one. But where? Oh, I know. How about up there? Oh, you must pardon me. I forgot you have no way of making it up to that divine beast on your own. Good luck sealing the darkness! Screw you, Reen. Uh, Rivali. Descendant! Descendant, are you alright? My apologies. I fear I have said far too much. If there is anything you do not understand, please do not hesitate to ask. So I was just constantly throughout that. I was like, that's just Reen. I could just hear Reen constantly throughout that. It's like, mm. I mean, his voice is doing a good job. It's like the voice is different, but it's like, we're playing Cold Steel at the moment. It's like, that's very much all I'm hearing. Right, so. You said it was a straight shot this way or something, didn't you? I want to head that way. So, yeah, search for the flight range. So it's actually that way. Okay. Seems odd that you directed me in the opposite direction. It's just very, very strange. So, unless I can get some, like... Can I maybe, like, buy a flight? God is landing. Hmm... Hello. Say, Traveller. I take it you've seen Divine Beast Van Meadow. Everyone's in a loss as what to do now. I can't help but sigh every time I look skyward. And will we be able to go back to living a relaxed life here? Maybe move? I mean, yeah, sure, it'll be a trek and stuff like that. It'll be an arduous journey, but move? That makes sense to me. Just, just, just leave this place. So hopefully we can get across quite nicely. It's clear we're meant to head this way. It's like, why was it pointing me over there? It just seems very, very strange when it's like, it's clearly over here. We'll also go do that uh, trial there if I can. You know how it is. It's like that, that one that we did in the previous part. Jeez. Like, considering how hard it was, I didn't do that badly. Still need to, like, you know, learn the combat better because I've not had an opportunity to properly do that yet. I think it's because of the cold we should equip that. Now you can see I've used me amiibos again. I need to find a place to sell them. So yeah, it's like with that on, we should be much better with the cold now. Still got a problem with the cold, so let's actually see about that. 
So the warm double. Okay, we should be good for it. Oh, I didn't want to do that. Just missing the wrong button at the wrong time there. Watch out, mate. Back off. Whoa, hello. I did not expect that to happen. Let's go, let's go, 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 go. Whoa. It's a good job I had that fairy. I just died. It's very, very strange. Right. Shawavu Shrine, okay. Duck a dung. Yes, 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 we, we know this, we know this. Let's go inside. Duck a ding. Yes, 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 we know this as well. Let's get inside, get inside. Get inside already. Go, 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 go. Got things to do, places to be, people to see. Okay, so what we got. Ooh. To you who sets foot in this shrine, I am Shawabo. In the name of the goddess healing, I offer this trial. What is it? Half of hidden winds. Okay. Intriguing. Seems like a so far. Oh god. <laughs> that was quite cool. <gasps> money! Lovely, lovely money! Yeah, this seems fairly easy so far. Oh crap. <laughs> so, spoke too soon, spoke too soon. So, uh, turn around, Link. Link, turn around. Turn around. God damn it, Link. Let's face the right way this time. Okay. It's like, yeah, I could land on that, but where's the fun in that? Oh, I'm gonna do it my way. Because it's more fun that way. Where's the thing? Where's the thing? Where's the thing? Go, 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 go. It's like, uh, I got there. I got there. I got there. Okay. So that was it? No. Which is some grand revelation at that point. Where's the hidden winds aspect of this? Is it because it's here and I can't see a way up? Hmm. Is that it? Seems there's like some secret. Hmm. So what's that up there? That's the question. Hmm. I have a chest, okay. Hmm. So what am I going to do there to get that one? Because I... Um, duh, 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 duh. Not that, what am I thinking? That. Oh! I must have had you from that alone. Okay, so let's see here. I could come back and get that later. We shall see, though. All right, give it one more attempt. Oh, thank you. Oh, what? I will leave it for now. You get the idea of what I will do. It. Ah, no, 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 no. Come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on. We'll just finish off, we'll finish off the shrine. Finish off the shrine. Because we know roughly what we're doing here now. Roughly. Still got to figure out that though. Hmm. There's some way. 
It says hidden window, so I'm assuming there is a hidden window or something somewhere. So it's like, huh, how do I get higher from here? Is it just a big updraft at some point? Is there a ladder on there? Ah, ha, ha! Hidden wind. And then... Over there. Ha, ha, ha! Yes. I was just thinking, like, where's this hidden wind? Ooh! Okay, so let's actually see about getting rid of one of them then. Um... No. Drop that. Very, very clever. It's cool. But it's like, yeah, it's like, well, there had to be a hidden wind somewhere, because it's, it's got the Shrine of the Hidden Wind. Well, Shrine of the Hidden Wind, you know. It's just like, it had to be somewhere, because it was too obvious where everything was. There we go! Da -da -da -da. Da -da 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 -da. Me, 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 me. Your resourcefulness in overcoming this trial speaks to the promise of a hero. We know. Do, 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 do. I like that one. That was fun. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. You know, the usual stuff. Yeah, that, that was a fun one. Just because it's like. I was still. I was just waiting for that little trick somewhere. And then it gave it me. It's cool. Would be nice if it loaded faster. What were the load times before the patch, by the way? I want I still want a video to see this. Someone get me a video of like how long the loading times were, because if it was like significant enough people would be like, oh that's so much better. Like, what was it like before? I've not got far to travel anyway, it's only over here. What's going on there? Hmm. Force a habit that now by pressing that when I've jumped up. Yeah. Teba. I don't know you. And I'm actually pretty busy here. You should probably go. Okay, bye. That was it? Can I steal your bow? He's doing the arrows. He's doing that. You do need something. I'm busy here. I can help you. Help me. With what exactly? Van Meadow. Oh, Van Meadow. Let me get this straight. Some random Hillian wants to help me bring down Divine Beast Van Meadow. I'm not buying it. What's your name, stranger? I'm Link. Link, huh? Oh, Link. I'm Teba. But you already knew that. I'm guessing the Elder asked you to come here and... Talk some sense into me, am I right? That's right. Just like the elder to trust any fool wandering into town. Look, you seem like an alright guy, but, but let's make one thing clear. I'm not going anywhere. As a Rito warrior, I can't rest until my people are safe. There's only one way I'm going back to Rito village. And that is... In a body bag. Uh, uh, once divine beast of our meadow falls from the sky... I have to kill Meadow, so be it. Only then will I return to the village. Then let's get down to business. Hmm. Are you serious? Hmm. Huh. Well, far be from me to talk to you off the ledge. But it's, as the Elder said, the only way to stop Divine Beast of Van Meadow is to get inside it. But chance of that happening, there's no way we can set foot in Meadow. Actually... <laughs> so are you... Are you wingless? You're brainless too. Let me fill you in. The only people able to enter the Divine Beasts are the five champions of old. Unfortunately for us and the rest of Hyrule, they all died a hundred years ago. If it hadn't been for Ganon. Hmm. Never mind. Let's focus on bringing down Meadow, one step at a time. If we approach Meadow recklessly, its cannons will blast us out of the sky before we even get close. 
So I'm going to need to test you before I take you with me. We Rito warriors used the updraft in this ravine to hone our aerial ac archery skills. The updrafts are so strong here that a person could just open up a cloth over their head and float up easily. Let's see what you're capable of. Have to maneuver through the air and destroy five of the targets set up in this valley in three minutes. I'm ready! Go destroy five targets with your arrows. Cool. So it's like paraglide shoot, paraglide shoot, paraglide shoot. It's kind of cool. Keep it up. Oh, I got it. Okay, come on back. Mm. You're a skilled archer. Well, it was as if time stopped with everything, with, with everything. The very arrow you let fly. What to tell you, Link? When you first showed up, I thought someone was pulling a prank on me. After seeing you handle that bow, I can tell you the real deal. Must have seen a battle or two. Hundreds of them. I believe it. Link, I feel I've heard that name somewhere before. Well, if you really want to help bring down Meadow, it's now or never. I'll get you into position so you can give its cannons all you've got. Hmm. Inside that treasure chest is a bow I've modified. Take it. Let me know when you're ready. Let's get on it. Falcon bow. A high, highly refined Rito made bow created by a master Rito craftsman. Rita Warriors favorite for a superior rate of fire, which helps them excel even further at aerial combat. Ventry is full. Well, of course it is. Um da, 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 da. So let's 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 drop one of these. I'm bothered picking these things up. I need more inventory. Really do. Right, so. Okay, it's time to face Divine Beast Van Vamido. No more arrows won't put a dent in those cannons. You need to hit them with bomb arrows. These are precious commodities, so don't expect me to do this again, but take these bomb arrows. Oh. Also, it'll be cold up there. You want to prepare a warm meal or bring some warm clothes? Um, wait a second. Hmm. Huh. So, right, so we want to equip them. And um, we want to... <laughs> little thing going on. No, not that. Uh, which one was that? That one, wasn't it? Oh, no, it's this one. It's not the falcon bow. Falcon bow. Okay, cool. And let's see about food for the cold, just in case. Lovely. Let's go. I'm ready. All right. Let me ask you something. Why are you doing this? I risk your life to bring down Meadow. To save Rito Village. Rito Village. It's not like you'll get the keys to the village, you know. I won't? Oh, well. Change my mind. I'm off. Well, that's nice, but no changing your mind. Ah, oh, once you get up there and see Meadow up close. That's fair enough. Right. Get on. There we go, then. All right, it's showtime. Man, even I feel like I'm going to freeze up here. There's the whoa! There's Divine Beast Vamido. There's a barrier up again. What a pain! What's wrong, Link? Too scared to talk? Too difficult to talk? Let's go over the plan. You see those cannons? I'll draw their fire. When I'm doing that. Use your bomb arrows to destroy the cannons. Got it so far? You need to withdraw for a bit. Just spread your cloth and float straight up in the updraft for a while. And I'll take that as a sign that you need to regroup. We need to regroup. Don't bother aiming for anything covered by Meadow's barrier. It's impenetrable. And whatever you do, don't get close enough to touch it. And finally, I know I've said this a few times already, but don't forget your cold protection. 
You can move whenever you're ready. Let's go. All right. Now to go blow up those cannons. It's up to you. Be careful. It's like, I want to get close, don't I? It's dipping too far at that point. Be careful. It's got that one. Got that one. Okay, this is pretty cool. Just avoid that whenever we can. It's targeting us. Yeah, we're fine. Do that there. Just missing it. Just missing it. That's the way. I'm assuming there's one over there. Don't touch the barrier. This is pretty. Are all the divine beasts like this? Don't tell me. That's me just being sort of like speaking out loud, sort of thing. Kind of cool is this massive updraft, though. Be nice if we had that constantly. It's targeting, us. It's targeting me. You think you're fine? One more. Yeah, man. Because it's like, could I not fly off into like a really far area? I run out of stamina. I know, but Watch out. it's fine. It's fine. Got him. That's got him. We did it. Shield's gonna go down? Why would the shield go down with that? No idea. Oh, it's angry now. Well done, Link. That thing is history. Question is now what? Bad news, Link. It looks like I got hit pretty good back there. I think I think I need to get back to the flight range. I just hope that I can make it back. You head down to Meadow. Good luck. It's all you. Funny if Link put his thumb up and be like, Yay! Like, oh no, I've let go of my paraglider. Woo! I did see like a Sheikah Slate pedestal thing there. I'm assuming that's why we're the only ones who can actually get on it, etc. Travel gate registered to map. I was going to say, what if I fall off? Well, now, I've seen that face before. Okay. I had a feeling you would show up eventually, but making me wait a hundred years is a bit indulgent. You're here to wrest control of Meadow away from Ganon, correct? If so, then the first thing you'll want to do is find yourself a map. This is essentially a dungeon. That guidance stone has the information for the layout of this divine beast. Can you make it there? Maybe? Right, so... I'm actually going to end this part here. This is a, a lovely place to... start from in the next part. It's like I am getting this chest. <laughs> I was gonna... Like, just, oh god. 
There's an eyeball looking at me there. Sapphire, cool. Hey. Hello. Oh, that's a bomb. Oh no, I don't want to use the bomb one. Oh, it died. Hmm. Well, if I'd have known that we're going to do that, I would have done that sooner. Right, so, yes, we're going to end this part here, and in the next part we'll proceed inside what is probably our first, like, proper, proper, proper dungeon thing, I assume. So, we shall see you then. Ta-ta for now.